right, we said we'd see you next time, and this is next time. What's up, gamers? How's it going? Has, um, you know, North Korea nuked us yet? If so, you're probably not going to see this episode. If you are, we made it another year, so speaking, congrats Speaking us. of, what was the present that they were going to give us? Remember that? Did you see that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. They are like, oh, crap, we forgot. Uh, just send them a vase. They'll be fine. Just send them a vase. We'll be fine. But, yeah. All right, so last time we talked about Gravity Falls, let's talk about another show that you're watching that I got you into. Death Note. Okay. How far are you into Death Note? Episode 12 right now. I need. I haven't had Not a lot of time. Not far enough. Okay. Uh-uh. No, no, no. I'm, I'm waiting for the terrible episode 25, because I don't <laughs> even know what it is. But that show gives me anxiety. Mm. That's such a, it's such a good show. It's a show. It's a good show, but it gives me anxiety. Like, I was shaking after, like, watching one of the episodes. Really? And I'm like, oh, God, how is he going to pull this? It was the one where he tricks Ray Pember's wife mm. and into killing her, well, into giving her name up. Yeah, well, basically killing herself. Yeah, yeah basically. And I'm like... Oh my god, and it's just an episode of him trying to, like, get in her head. And, you know, I, I was just... Ah. That, that was one of my favorite arcs, just because it showed you just how intelligent this high school student is. Well, I guess he's a college well, student. College student at that point, but, but like... still, still. It, he does... He is canonically the, like, one, the best student in, like, Japan or something. Oh, right? yeah. I'd, I'd say he's probably the best student in the world. Um, just... Oh. Oh, it's my phone. Okay. Maybe not my virtual boo. My virtual boo, you mean? Ah, uh, yes. 16 frames per second. Goodness. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um. So, I already know a little bit about the show, and I talk to Chevelle about it sometimes. Mm -hmm. Uh, Chevelle's a kid, uh, that we're friends with at our school. Um. And so, I'm like, I know Mika Mika has a death note. Um, but like, when does she come on? What do you mean? The pop star, Mika Mika. Um, soon enough. Before, before episode 25. Well, duh. Because isn't she like, she, I'm assuming she's the second Kira. Yes. I will tell you that, yes, she is the second Kira. Um, but like, doesn't like just another guy just doesn't just another Shinigami like send a death note after he saw what happened with uh um no that's not what happens you'll you'll see what happens I mean that was just what I thought like might happen based on mm -hmm. uh you know oh coins nice where did get all of this stuff <laughs> that's a good question Ghosts are just canonically rich, I guess. Well, they're always, they're always... It's never, like, a haunted, like, small, like, house. It's always a mansion. So... Why don't you get that gem if you got the other one? I already got that gem. I still got, like, the sword effect. Aw, oh, boo. Pat, get it. I don't, I'm not gonna catch you. I don't care. So what's the reason that... That, that can always confuse me. Why did they not just use booze in the first Luigi's Mansion? They did have booze in the first Luigi's Mansion. I know, but why didn't they only use booze and just variations of? Because that would have been weird. I don't know. Well, you think it's... A, would you really want to have to fight against multiple different kinds of booze? Because I wouldn't. I mean, I don't know. That'd be annoying. There, there are canonically more than one type of boo. Well, yeah, in the paper universe. Well, no, no, not even in the paper universe. In the... Mario and Luigi too, but like I'm talking like electric boogaloo. Even in a uh, Mario Galaxy, there's bomb boos mm -hmm. that like blow up if they touch you. Yeah, and you can grab their tongues and swing them around like a uh, like a lasso. Uh, kind of like a lasso, yeah. Stop calling me. Watch this. Ooh. I have a turbo controller, so I just like click the A button there. Can you play it? This is Spencer. Oh, yeah, you have to blow. Very cool. <laughs> also, uh, did I ever tell you why I play the baritone? No. Alright, so I wanted to play the clarinet at first. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Well, and then I figured out that I can't, like, get my mouth to the right shape to play it. Like, I can hardly play woodwinds at all. Like, I can, I still, like, can't play. Like, Jackson, like, let me try his saxophone and I still couldn't play it. Like, even after all this time and knowing mm. what I'm supposed to be doing. Gotcha. And, uh, but, like, that's why I didn't end up playing um, the clarinet. And then my second choice after that was a French horn. But the idiot guy who was my instructor said, no, you have to have straight A's or I'm not letting you play it. <laughs> and I'm like, well, frick, I have B's sense. in some oh. classes, so I guess I don't get to play my second favorite instrument. Your second favorite in favorite instrument is the French horn? Well, it was at the time. That was the one that I was going to choose. Um, and my cousin, who was in high school, played the uh, tuba. And I'm like, all right, well, that, yeah. That's what he did a lot. Nice. He did the veggie tales. That's what I wanted to play the tuba. And then I started taking piano. I was like, cool, a real instrument. That's nice. <laughs> Why is it a, what, what qualifies it as a real instrument? Yeah. Here, the, the piano can be played on its own and sound good. But if you play, like, just a flute by itself... It'll sound good. Like, you can play a melody, but you can't play, like, the full thing. With a piano, you can just do a lot of different stuff. Uh, the like, kind of like a guitar, but you it's a lot harder to play melodies on guitar. Guitar's a better... I mean, uh, just like a chord instrument. While you can have just a piano, I feel like it is better... It's, it's always better to have a second instrument. Like... You know, because like, I know what, even sometimes when they play just the piano, like even sometimes when it's primarily piano, usually they have a backup violin or something. Oh yeah. That way it can be out actually. Mm -hmm. But the thing is like, I'd rather listen to a really, really good piano player than like a really, really good saxophone player because they could do so much more Well, it stuff depends. Epic sax so guy. More. Well, yeah. Epic sax guy. But then you have like freaking... Um, the, the bald dude, Seth Everman. Oh, yeah. Like, I could listen to him. Or any, or any to... Asians, really. I could listen to him forever. Oh, well, yeah. he has a synth, which I guess is fundamentally different than a piano. It's, 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 it can play like a grand it can, piano. Though, it can so play like a grand piano, but it fundamentally is not. It, it's still really... What he does is still really cool, though. Like, uh, taking all the different songs and stuff. Oh, yeah. But <laughs> Honey, get the eye bleach. <laughs> thumbnail. Wait, do they come into frame with him at some point? Because that'll uh, be probably. a thumbnail. Hold on. Oh, one. I just noticed we have a black bar. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh no. Oh no, don't just gonna kill us. It, yeah, he will. But Oh man. Oh, Narts. It's fine. No one's watching this. Even if they do. Like, it bothers me at least. Um, luckily, the new TV monitor, whatever. Tucker's, Tucker, like, complains about my thing. Like, it's 22 inches. It's not a TV. And I'm like, Tucker, I will slap you Tucker across the face. Tucker just likes to complain about a lot of stuff. He does. And he, like, it's like. And it's not even like he's educated about it. He's just kind of an idiot sometimes. Yeah. Like, Dal is, Dalton at least sounds intelligent. Here's the thing about Dalton. He's not watching this because it's a me and you series. Mm -hmm. Dalton, no, it's Tucker, Tucker, Tucker. There we go. That's what I want to talk about. Tucker wants to be on the channel, but doesn't really have a personality per se. For it? Yeah. No. So I don't really know what he'd do. I don't either. And like, oh gosh. Me. <laughs> but like, I wish I could do that. Just become the piano. Now it's Super Mario sixty four. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oof. Oh, speaking of pianos and stuff, have you ever seen the anime Your Lie in April? No. Oh my God! You need to watch it. You know, I'm going. I, I try to refrain from actually watching animes. Well, no, it's it's on Netflix, and it's like, 
12 episodes long. It's not even that long. Where do you not get these one. from? You don't keep bombs in your pianos? Um, I try not to. Loser. Luigi with these <laughs> Luigi with these hoops. Bada bing, bada bam. Nope, not there. There. Good job, Luigi. And banana slammer. Luigi's a buff boy. I was about to say, yeah, he's buff. Well, I don't like this fight. He used to beat up a piano, and I can't do that. Would you slam him onto the piano, or I mean, can I won't really do anything more. And here, ladies and gentlemen, we have the tortured artist, Edgar Allan Poe. Boop, boop, gone. The sound of butt cheeks clapping, clapping at my chamber door. <laughs> thrap, thrap, thrapping at my chamber door. Rap, rap, rapping, as they never have before. Quoth the Raven, never, never more. more. <laughs> that was it. I love it. Edgar Allan Poe, I, I actually like his poetry in his stories. It's not bad. They're just really dark. And, are, kind of yeah, they are, at some points. like your jokes. Yeah, but my jokes aren't that dark, though. They're not as dark. They're not like, oh, hey, uh, the guy's going crazy. Oh, what? What? Bull crap. Frickin' work. Um, anyway, the only time that, the only, one of the only times I've used anything I've learned during, like, the Edgar Allan Poe section was that, like, Thanato means death. Oh, fan off. Yeah, yeah. And so and there was an enemy in a game, and it was called the Thanato Beast or something. And I'm like, it's literally just called the Death Beast. Like, <laughs> why are we fighting this thing? Because it's the Death Beast. And it was, and it's stupid because it regenerates. Who are you? Like, you beat it, and then the game pulls a fast run on you and says, well, actually, it just comes back from the dead. It was already dead, yeah. And, and what then, the heck? You got stopped by the piano. And then, like, you beat it again, and it you have to fight it three consecutive times before it, like, actually, like, perishes. And you don't even kill it. Someone just punches it really hard, and it goes to the stratosphere. Mm -hmm. Also, that's the second time you got hit in that exact spot. Oh, how the turntables... Who's operating this spotlight, by the way? The ghost conductor, of course. Well, not the ghost conductor. The ghost, um... Director, visual arts director, yeah. The ghost Dalton. The ghost Dalton. Oh yeah, it actually is the ghost Dalton because that is what Dalton did. Would you go back and watch that play? Well, yes. Yeah. I'd go back and watch almost every play I've seen, except for like any of the ones that our church has put on, because they're little kids. They're little kids. Except for the ones that I did and the one that Noah did, because ours were great. Like Wait, Isaiah ones Jones that you were in? Yes. You talking crap down here? I heard my name. We were uh, talking about being the freaking, um, what are the, like the visuals, visual director or something. Uh, when, when you were, talked when about you did the you, play, uh, the lights uh, and stuff. The light, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what my title was there. Lights director. Maybe. Interesting. Hmm. Anyway, we're, we're Interesting. fighting this man. He's in the piano. I fighting a piano and it's making me sad. We're fighting the piano man. Billy Joel? In the flesh? Break! Minus 10. Alright, I'm out of here. Yeah, I don't. See ya. Love you. Bye. No homo. Come on, Luigi. Go on and hit the man. What? What? Bull crap. That was kind of bull crap. Not gonna lie. I'm just gonna sit here. There we go. Bank shot. <laughs> this should break the piano. This has been three hits. I know. And those are bombs. Yeah. But it's a sturdy piano. It looks like it's made out of metal, no. is the thing. Oof, the piano's corpse. My favorite, alright. Quick switch to choir talk. My favorite part about uh, when I did choir was is that when we'd sing, we would all kind of stand around the piano and kind of like, and I thought it was really cool. But I mean, oh yeah, it's fun. But now no one sings except for the people who like choir. So I know, and everyone else is just like it's a free art credit. It's like no, and and I hate that because you hate it. Yet you're not even in the art program. I hate it so much. 
I'm in band. Okay, but you're not in the choir program. That's what I I'm meant. I'm in band and art, actually. You're not so in the I'm choir in two program. Art and so I'm you can't not. really complain about that. I as can much complain as I can. because I know. It, it is just, you know, because next year we're going to have like an advanced choir. So, and then just a choir. AKA you. Me. Chevelle. I guess Spriggs Sprig is graduating. But that's okay. I don't really like her voice oh, yeah. as much as everyone else does. Frick, I'm a senior next year. Yes. Good times. Ah! We're going to be 17. We're going to be 17 this year, Spencer. You know what that means. We're going to be the dancing queens. You are the... Remember Winter Retreat? Yes. Oh, I'm excited to go to Winter Retreat this year. Disco girl coming through. Ooh, that girl is you. Ooh, I, ooh, all right. ooh, ooh, ooh. Gravity Falls parodies are all right, and that yes. is it. Don't start unbelieving. <laughs> they were just a bit too... I mean, I get the joke they were trying to make, and it worked for what they needed it to, but it was just a bit too weird to be too funny. You know? I don't know. I thought they were good. They were, they were... It's just... That's just Gravity Falls style. In you go. Is that the episode? Yep. Yeah. All right, well, that sure was fun. Oh, what's this cutscene? It doesn't matter. Bye.